Welcome to Lessons with John. Uh, today we're going to try Rainy Day Women number 12 and 35. Don't ask me, I don't know. It's the song uh, Bob Dylan wrote that uh, everybody must get stoned. Okay, that's how we all know it. All right, uh, we're going to do it on the ook. Uh, we're going to try in the original key, okay? Uh, F7, fourth string, second fret, uh, second string, first fret, third string, third fret, open first string, okay? That's my F7 chord. Uh, we're going to need uh, a bunch of new chords for you. I've seen this um, done and people are really fudging. They don't like the diminished chord, okay? So don't be afraid of the diminished chord. I know it's scary, but you got to get over it. All right, so my next chord is the F diminish 7. Um, it's the 4th string 1st fret, 2nd string 1st fret, 3rd string 2nd fret, 1st string 2nd fret. I'm going to use all four fingers for that one. And uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go from an F diminished 7 to an E diminished 7. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take that chord and just pull it back, lift my one and two fingers up, and just go back that way. And now I've got the third string, uh, first fret, and the first string, first fret, and that's my E diminished 7. And that, that is a bit of a challenge, um, especially if you have big hands on the ook, to try and get that clearly, but that's the easiest way to do it, okay? So, uh, and then, uh, so let's let's get started on it. Uh, that Those three chords will get you about a third of the way into the song. So we got the F7, and I'm going to go down, down, up, just like that. Then I'm going to go to the diminish, the, the F diminish, I'm just going to do a down or a down, up. Either one will do. I'll probably do a down, up, okay? And then I'm going to pull it back to the E diminish and do a down, up on that. So it sounds like this. Okay? I fudged it a little bit, sorry. Uh, and then in the next measure you got F7 for the whole pattern or the whole measure. So I'm going to do down, down, up, up, down, up on that one, okay? So those are really all your strums you're going to need for the whole song. So F7, F diminished 7, E diminished 7, F7. Again, F7, Okay, that'll get you that far. Uh, I'll play through the whole song at the uh, at the end. All right, so uh, well, maybe not the whole song, but the whole pattern. It it it's a pattern that repeats for the whole song. Okay, so next we need a B flat seven. We're gonna bar the whole first fret and then third string second fret. We're gonna hold down. And I'm gonna do that same down down up on that one. And then this one's easier. Uh, at least I feel it is. Uh, it's a B flat diminished 7. We're going to play that at the 1st string 3rd fret, 2nd string 3rd fret, uh, sorry, I said 1st string, 4th string 3rd fret, 2nd string 3rd fret, 3rd <laughs> string 4th fret, 1st string 4th fret. I can see why other guitar tutorials don't give out the chords like the fingerings and stuff. They say just, just do this. <laughs> It's a nightmare. Um, all right, so that's a B flat diminished seven, and then I'm going to go backwards. So I just move everybody back a half step. Um, back is this way on the hook. All right, um, and it's an A diminished seven. So you end up on the fourth string second fret, second string second fret, third string third fret, first string third fret. Okay, and then you're back to the B flat seven. So that is just the same pattern as we did, but on a, in a different uh, different chords. So it's a B flat, B flat seven. Okay, so it was a B flat seven to a B flat diminished seven, A diminished seven, B flat seven, and then you go back to your F seven pattern. Okay, so that was F seven, F diminished seven, E diminished seven, back to F seven. Then you're in luck. You got a C7 chord. Last chord. First string, first fret. And you're going to do this for two patterns, two whole measures. He just goes down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down. And then the F7, F diminished 7, E diminished 7, F7. Now you've got everything you need for the song as far as the, like the chords and the strum patterns. So I'm going to try and play through the whole thing. Keep in mind this ook is tiny. All right. Uh, I'm going to just play through it the first time, okay? Again, this 
this is the beginning again, so F7, F diminished 7, E diminished 7, F7. F7, F diminished 7, E diminished 7, F7. B flat 7, B flat diminished 7, A diminished 7, B flat 7. F7, uh, F diminished 7, E diminished 7, F7. And then C7. F7, F diminished 7, E diminished 7, and F7. Wow, that's hard to say. I need water now. Okay, uh, that is it. It just cycles around for the whole song. Uh, I didn't put in the horn parts, those cool horn parts. Da -da -da -dum, -da -da. I didn't bother with those. Um, you got enough work with all those chords. All right, uh, don't be afraid of the diminished chord. It could be your friend. Uh, they used it in, uh, in movies when the girl was tied onto the railroad track. And then they would go up in the diminished chord and stuff. So uh, that's that's where it comes from. It's an evil sound. So <laughs> okay, uh, play more Ookins. Please subscribe.